Hello there Steve-O's and welcome to Steve's Game of Horrors. In this video I'm going to be playing The Evil Within 2 on my Xbox One console. Uh, so obviously in the previous episode I played uh, The Evil Within game. Little bit scary admittedly, little bit scary. But uh, we're going to see what this one is like. I'm just going to turn this down for a little bit because it's a little bit loud for my liking. There we go. Um, so yeah, so there we go. Uh, let's see what this game is like. I will, uh, first of all, apologise because at the time of filming this video, I, you know what's weird is this, this series has been cursed. Like, literally, this Game of Horrors series that I've been doing for the last couple of weeks now has been cursed. A couple of weeks ago, I couldn't get my Xbox to connect to my TV. Last night, I couldn't find uh, my Xbox One controller that I usually play with. So, I had to, obviously, f I found a spare Xbox controller, but I didn't have any AA batteries. So, I had to go and get some AA batteries. So I've got some AA batteries and now I'm able to, I'll turn it all the way up, uh, and now I'm able to obviously play my Game of Horror series. Right, okay, we are going to play a new game and we are going to see what this game is like. Uh, survival, casual, let's do casual, aim assist, uh, let's enable it because I don't, I'm not really good at aiming, that's what she said. Um, <laughs> I don't even know, that doesn't even make any sense. Um, <laughs> oh dear. Um, um, <laughs> okay. What's, what's going on here? Are we in hell? Are we burning in hell? It's okay. There's a reservation if that if there is a case. There's a reservation for me, no. right? No, this is not happening. It is happening. Can you not see? It's on fire. Ah, uh, you're not. You're not. You no. We don't have to, do we? Oh God, Lily. No. Open the damn door! Oh, no, actually, don't do it. See, this is what happens. Can you not call 999? Or 911? Where are you going? Damn it! Don't. Look. Why? Billy, I'm here! Where are you? Oh god, I'm here. She's upstairs. Okay, well, can you... How are you supposed to get upstairs? Well, it looks like I'm taking the long way round. Looks like Lily might end up dying. How did this happen? Uh, well, no, maybe she left her hair tongs on. You know, like her curling tongs. Maybe maybe she left them on. Um... I'm coming, Lily. Just hold on. He's downstairs. I'm here, Lily. I'm here. Well, what room is she in? This is what I want to know. She's not in that one, is she? No. Well, that one's like completely burning. There we are. I'm guessing, is she in that room? No, it's locked. Well, she's definitely not in that room. The only other room I can... Th ah, hang on, is she in that one? Ah, yeah, she'll be in this one. Ah, look, Lily, yeah. Lily? Come on out. Lily! She's not there. Where are you? I'm here. Dad's here. 
weren't here for me, Dad. Oh, no. What? Oh no! Jesus! Oh, oh okay, alright, it's just a dream. Sebastian. It's been a long time. Three years. I've been trying to track you down for three years. And you thought you'd find me at the bottom of an empty bottle. Is that it? And why are you here now, damn it? You didn't find me because they didn't want you to. Calm down, Sebastian. You knew what was going to happen in that hospital, didn't you? What happened at Beacon is in the past. You need to forget it. You sound just like that psychologist that forced shoved down my throat. But he didn't have answers. You do. You're gonna tell me about Mobius. I'm here because of this. still alive. Lily is dead! I read the police report! I was at her funeral! We can rewrite history if we want to. Staging a death is child's play. Why would I come out of the shadows just to lie to you? Lily is alive. She's with us, but she's in danger. We need you to help save her. Save her? What have you done to her? Get your hands off me. Hoping you'd come willingly, Sebastian. But we don't have time for this bullshit. We need you. Lily needs you. of our facilities. So this is the almighty Mobius, huh? Be careful about what you say. You don't know how powerful they are. Right. So powerful they have to kidnap a washed-up ex-cop to help them. <laughs> At least your terrible sense of humor is still intact. Enough of this bullshit. Where's Lily? Patience. All your answers are right here. Mental hospital incident was an unfortunate setback. But we used the knowledge gained to build a new and vastly improved STEM system. What does this have to do with my daughter? Imagine it. Millions of miles. This is a very long intro, honestly. Very, very long intro this was. Uh, 
Okay, let's hope and pray now that we can actually play the game. This is very trippy. I just want to. I want to start playing the game. A cat. I don't ever remember owning a cat. You're not going to pick it up, are you? He looks evil. He's got red eyes. Slide projector. Where did my memory dig this up? Elementary school. All right, well there we go. Well, let's play the projector. The cat's wandering around. Okay, so there's only one on there. Kidman, you there? Well, the cat doesn't seem to be evil. No, it's that. Just override that. Right, okay. Well, it's official. This game is probably the trippiest game I've ever played. Oh, I just saw something this a day. No, don't want to do that. Um, I mean, where? How do I? Oh, okay. I'm back in my office now. I don't, want, I don't want to be back in my office. I'm guessing that there is no way out. See, I don't understand what's with the cat. Is it going to take me back to the projector? Which I don't want. Interesting game. What about if there is there anything on the computer? No. What about the telephone? No. Okay. Nothing at all. 
All I can hear is the meow meows of the cats. That's all I can hear now. Um, I mean, to be honest, let, let me go back into... Oh, okay. Well, there's no need to force the thing open. Jesus. Is there anything in my office? Well, let's say my office. In Sebastian's office. That we need... So confusing. I really drew this picture of me. Oh. It was burned up along with everything else in the house. My first commendation. It feels like another lifetime. I guess because it was. Looking back at some old memories, I guess. Photos of a bunch of Mobius agents. Here. Oh. Your lost team, I see. That's them. Let us know if you locate any of them. You're our only line of communication into STEM. They're stuck in Union and searching for Lily, too. Union? This STEM environment was designed to look and feel like a small town called Union. Great. So your experts need rescuing, too. If anyone can do it, it's you. Thanks for the vote of confidence, but I'm only here to find Lily. There's more info. Ah, right, here we go. Chapter 2. Something not quite right. Sykes. A tech. But at least he has some small arms training. Okay. Julian Sykes, age 30. Male. Uh, 5 for 8, 160 pounds. Okay. STEM. I still don't understand why you can't just take them all out of their pods and wake them up. It doesn't work that way. Without a core, we're totally locked out of the system. To forcibly remove anyone from STEM at this point would kill them and leave their consciousness trapped inside there. Great. Mobius has got some stellar backup plans. Stating the obvious isn't going to speed things along. You need to find Lily. Otherwise she, you, and everyone else is is going to die. Um. Baker. Team leader. He's the guy I should try to find first. Harrison. Combat specialist, huh? Hopefully he can take care of himself. Must not have been expecting trouble if they sent in all these technicians. Seize. Okay. Interesting. This game is trippy, but interesting at the same time. Wrong. We don't 
Paul's head is broke. It's okay. Mom can fix it for you. She can fix anything. Sebastian? What's wrong? Are you all right? I've got a wonderful family. An amazingly smart and beautiful wife. Why wouldn't I be all right? Come here, Myra. You've been working too hard. It's making you delirious. Are you sure you're not coming down with something? This is, um, very trippy. Is this the right place? Closed by itself. Well, that's just a painting on the wall. Hmm. Very interesting. There's some doors there. Can't open them. Locked. Yeah. Locked as well. Ah, uh, this one. All the doors are locked, which is a bad sign. Ah, get on wall. Okay. That's the door I just came through. Wasn't it? Oh, okay, no, oh, okay, maybe not. Oh, maybe it was this one I was supposed to come through. What's in here? I mean, it's amazing, don't get me wrong, but at the same time, it's creepy. Rather creepy. Okay. Um, I'm assuming that in all the doors, so I think there's a couple of them. Oh. 
Alright, well, I'm gonna safely say this. What's that? Someone tried to block the way out. Or in. Alright, I'm gonna safely say this, okay? Because I'm gonna wrap this video up here. It's a rather creepy looking game. And very trippy as well. Like honestly, I do think this is probably the most trippiest game I've ever played. Because, well for one, it's a little bit weird. Though I can't get out that way. Um, for one, it's a little bit weird. But, second of all, I mean, I I'm not going to lie. This game is absolutely, I mean the graphics on this are absolutely astonishingly good. Um, you know, and I absolutely love, yeah, I mean, I love the way this game, you can play it and stuff like that. So, let me come out the door. And now I can't get out. What if I was to just, oh, you can't go through it, okay. There was going to be some sort of special hologram thing. Um, so yeah, so, there we go. Anyway, I'm going to end this video here. I think because this game is really really good very very trippy as well and definitely one that I'm going to be playing again I think in the future for sure um, it did it didn't really scare me but I think as you go on into the game I think it will like continue to to scare you really um, but anyway th thanks for watching I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up leave a comment in the comment section down below and feel free to hit that subscribe button as well. I'll be back with your next YouTube video again soon. But from me, goodbye. Thanks for watching. See you guys in my next YouTube video.